everybody, welcome back to another episode of Raft Survival. Today we are back, and today we set our sights upon the very top level of craftability. We are very close to being able to craft our circuit board. Actually, we'll be able to craft one today once we get all this copper smelted. But I've been smelting some vine and goo, waiting for an island to appear up ahead. We if all is said and done should be able to craft on up let's just get a empty water bottle that we're going to be needing get a little bit more vine goo and i think this should be the recipe for the success of me known as the oxygen bottle if you guys are new here playlist down below for y'all to go ahead and catch on up with this series if you guys haven't yet make sure you subscribe the notification bell hit to stay up to date with the series as it does come and other dope survival games we are playing and the murdering of the shark and if you're liking it let me know throughout the comment section down below and by smashing that like button. I'm a man of the people, and I gotta get the people what they want. So let me know it's what you want. But just last episode, we crafted up these new things to help us on out. We have been expanding the base a little bit too. Boop. We can go ahead and do that. Hopefully expanding the collection net system a bit. But here's the trick too. We're gonna wanna hit that island at a bit of an angle to hopefully allow us the ability to kind of like drift. Cause currently, uh, the way that we're sailing does not maximize stuff getting stuck in our nets. Because think about it this way. Like, imagine you're a net here, right? And you're only going to be able to get stuff from ahead of you, right? And this just seems very narrow. What we want is to be going straight forwards that way. Because then we will span the most imaginable, like, uh, stuff as it does fly by. Which is exactly what we are kind of in need of right now. We're So, mm, we're just going to want to angle this properly and then we could also let's make sure that we keep on schmelting stuff i think we need more vine goo for something but uh we do have flippers too so we are as kitted out as can be best weapons best equipment in the game we just gotta keep diving for the rest of this copper to craft up the finale of stuff and i seriously think that that's gonna be more than possible today although i definitely want to hit this island at that angle that i was talking about so it'll hopefully let us drift a little bit you know you, I think you know. I think you know. So just keep on aiming her. Steady, steady. I'll be more than ready to drop anchor as well and hopefully attack the shark. Uh, he might be kind of close to being dead. I've had to fend him off a couple times since the last episode, but I'm excited to see what these radio signals, these fabled signals of the radio might be. And okay, we're kind of like, kind of drifting into it a little bit here. We'll just maybe help turn us a little bit. Maybe I'm kind of waiting for the turn to hit and then I'll drop anchor once. Oh, oh, okay. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Hold on. This turn might be happening. Oh, oh, hey, hey shark. Not now. We're doing a freaking careful maneuver here. I'm trying to make sure my island goes properly. Uh, all in all, actually, why don't we? Oh, oh, there we go. We go this way. Uh, it's kind of going that way. It's getting a bit better. It's getting a bit better, uh, as long as this thing turns, like, a bit more. Is that still the shark, or is that, that stuff being collected? Okay. Tilted a little bit more. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay. That's actually a pretty great angle. I will take that. Let's drop anchor. I'm more than happy with where we lay now. That's a lot better of an angle than, like, going directly that way or directly that way. So, is it? Yeah, it's still looking pretty good. Let's just make sure that we have this thing pointed this way so we don't crash into the island and we let go of the anchor looks like nighttime's about to hit so maybe we can get one or two more dives in before the time for that comes continue actually at this point let's start smelting down this copper i i really do want to get some things crafted up and copper is ultimately the thing holding us back and hopefully we can find the copper in the depths down here especially with hold on hold on we need one more thing where are you at my flippers Flippa, 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 hey, oppa, hello, my flippa, get the oxygen, actually, no, because I think nighttime's about to set, let's just wait for nighttime to actually happen, because then we could dive during daytime, because water's already pretty dark, <laughs> water during nighttime is a disaster, my friends, but with the last remnants of the sun fading on away, let's lay down, have a quick nap, look at that, we're looking up at the god dang palm tree, what a photogenic type of sleeping view i don't know do people look at care about the view when they sleep nonetheless pretty cool stuff absolutely no clue how to even get up there maybe we could build a giant ramp but that's uh that's my best guess because mm, ain't no parkouring up that but that's okay what we're looking for ain't above it's below let's equip oh my god wait how did this regenerate did you guys see that Hold the phone. Our flippers weren't full quality, but now they are. I'm not questioning it. I'm rolling with it. 
Geronimo! Where art thou, man shark? Hold on. First things first, stab the shark in the face to hopefully scare him away a little bit and get him a little bit close to dying. And then we begin the search for these puppies. Little chunks of copper ore. That's what they look like. That's what we want, baby. That's what we want. Hello, shark. Would you want some more stabs? Of course you do. You want nothing but the stabs. Get back here. You will get the stabs, dang it. Whether you like it or not. Uh, now can I get some copper ore whether I like it or not? Ow! What? How did you sneak up on me like that? Like, look, that's the shenanigans I'm talking about with this shark. You gotta be careful with them. Alright, though. Let's give us a break here. Regenerate some health. Get some copper ingots. And once we get two copper ingots, we should be able to craft up... Not the calendar. Where is this thing? I always forget where it is. Yeah, wait. Hold, hold, hold a minute. Oh, there it is. Circuit board. Yeah. We're one away. This one uses some plastic, some vine goo. Oh, so it is a good thing we have vine goo. And then we got to use one to research. I'm guessing we're going to need one for the antenna and one for the receiver. But after that, that might be all the copper that we need. So four ingots we have. Once we craft one more, we'll have seven left over. So we should have enough for that. And then the question is, how much does the battery take? The battery is also going to take one. So... I think, unless one of these hits us with a switch up and like both of them need two circuit boards, we currently, ladies and gentlemen, have for ourselves enough copper to make some magic happen. Problem is, this ain't no super furnace. I wish that was the thing. I'd love to smelt some stuff down. So it still makes sense for us to continue diving. And at this point, honestly, any resources we get, if we're not using them to survive, we should be using them to build build up a little bit of the base and make it a bit more beautiful i think that's a marvelous idea while we wait for this well first off this stuff to craft because that's gonna apparently take a sec so that's just great i guess we can get an oh oh it literally finished as we said that there we go moment of truth suck it board welcome although you ain't sticking around for long you got to get researched and the moment of truth here will these recipes only require want to pop where do we get this stuff by the way over here no over here no there still no there we go navigation one circuit board oh two circuit boards so it's just gonna take a bit longer but we do have exactly enough copper because each circuit board is gonna be two copper so that's three circuit boards total plus the one we got there so we got seven copper or that means that we got to definitely keep oh we definitely got to get some more planks because we don't even have enough to keep these things going because copper does take a bit oh oh there goes that good thing i prepared for this very moment also you might be going star you're about to die of thirst no worries we prepared for this very moment the entirety of last episode when uh, we got this giant pool of fresh water here to go ahead and keep us company. As freaking to get it, boys. Ain't no need to go thirsty when you got puddles of clean water like I do. All right. You you swim in pools of you, you drink cups of water. I drink puddles of it. Okay. That doesn't sound as epic as I thought it would. Maybe maybe puddles aren't what they should. Uh, what Whatever. Anyways, we have a ton of water coming from there. So I got a good amount of food here in the form of the shark meat that we cooked up. And honestly, we could still get three more shark things. Hey! Oh, don't make it three, three more shark things, all right? I'm more than happy to kill you here, bud. More than happy to. You do drop absolutely delicious food. So, hey, I'm open ears. If you if you want to enter my belly, let me know. Just attack me again. I'll take that as a sign of uh, you want in my belly. I'm not getting in your belly, though. All right, we've tried that out. Or you've attempted to try that, but kind of hurts so that's gonna be a no for me dog uh we got random plastic there clogging that up all right well while this happens we still got a couple more planks from all the chopping we did let's definitely get these mangoes going back up let's let's go the fresh water is nice and ready to go i'm filling up on all those things and we'll have those growing for a backup supply can't really get up there for that wood so we're left here with two. Oh, and we should probably continue smelting the copper too, but we're left here with two wood and whatever we can pick up. Oh, <laughs> that guy saw me at the edge. He was like, come here, little star. Come here. And I'm like, yeah, that's a no for me, dog. That, though, is going to be a yes. We're up to eight planks, so uh, like we might just need to start sailing again. But given the direction of the wind, sailing should be pretty good. So, Geronimo, where are you? Oh, 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 oh. I don't think he hit us, though. Oh, yeah, there you go. I'm going to stab you, though. Got to scare you away. Keep you humble. Sit down and be humble, Mr. Shark. Sit down. Oh my, oh my God. This 
is what I like to see. What is this? More copper? There's more copper. Let's just get a little bit extra just in case we do need some more. I'd rather play it safe than have to wait for another island to pop up. We have so much oxygen. I don't I don't know what to do with so much oxygen in my life, man. It's a whole new sensation. Besides collect the bejesus out of everything down here with our hook that still is not broken. The shark that apparently doesn't care about me. Oh, he cares, he cares, he cares. As, dude, that's some Jaws type of stuff. As soon as I say that, man. Spooky. Let's get all the shark meat we can. Let's collect this thing right here. Collect. Oh, I don't know. Uh, YOLO. Let's get a little bit of this. What's the worst that can happen besides running out of oxygen? Nothing. Oxygen running out is the worst. Okay, maybe maybe a second shark popping up too. But that's the type of metal ore we're getting that we can smelt once this copper is good. And can say, oh my god. Talk about a buzzer beater. What is that? Oh, it's just a barrel. I thought that was an island for some reason. What's this? Some kind of weird, like, looks like a toy. I don't know. Looks like one of those old types of toys. Very specific. I know. Listen. I'm a man of very specific things, if you haven't noticed by now. And uh, I'm going to continue being as specific as can be. It's just my type of vibe. We also got to craft up a new one of these pretty soon. This puppy is about to break. And I'm not about that life. But this island is about the ore life, apparently. Because look at all that it's dropping. Is that the most random? Oh, well, rip to that. Okie dokie. I think that's a great point for us to get the hell out of Dodge. Unless we can craft another hook. And if we can, craft one on the lickety splits. What do we need to make the magic happen, baby? Hey! Magic just happened! Oh, hold on. Let's not go back down. Let's uh, continue. Yeah, putting planks in there, but then smelting all that copper that we got. And we'll be able to start crafting up all of this advanced machinery and following it to its end destination, wherever that might be. Um, I think there was... I think... Is this... Oh, I see a shark. I see it. Come on, come on, come on. Oi! There you go. Ain't getting the hit off on me. It's 50-50. Sometimes I feel like I stab him in the shark, but... I mean, stab him in the mouth, but he still comes out back for revenge like that. But no, I feel like sometimes I stab him and he stops attacking and other times he keeps attacking. Oh, look at that. It's making the nest over there. Totally adorbs, dude. Let's uh, get out of there. And at this point, I think I know where we got to go. And that is going to be. Oh, don't get scared away there, birdie. I like you sitting there. It's a nice decorative piece. Nothing like live animals. It's decoration. Sounds weird when you say it like that. Let's sway the anchor. Everything here is set for a much better path and trajectory. This is what we live for. I wonder if adding another sail would make us faster, though. Ooh. Do we have the resources to make such a thing happen? Make our boats maybe. Gonna need some more palm leaves and planks. Okay, it's gonna take a second. Because I'm using those planks for other things. Hope you don't mind. If we do have anything extra, though, honestly, why don't we get some more? Nope, we don't have enough extra for that. <laughs> I'm going to say some more crop plots so we can get more of those. But that's just going to need more wood and at this point. Eh, I think two is plenty for growing wood, especially because we're about to start picking up. Now that we've corrected the path, hopefully a mother load of wood. And then as soon as we get all this copper stuff done, we're going to just begin building. Honestly, we could, we could. Oh, yeah, look at all these planks already coming our way. Realistically speaking, I think we got a great opportunity here to expand the base. Something we haven't had the privilege of doing as of late. We just got to make sure that this thing's always got enough planks. But other than that, guys and gals, let's start having some fun, shall we? Look at this second floor we begin to build. This is going to be a double-decker type of ship. Although, we definitely need more planks. Okay. Mm, I don't know if I see planks up ahead and... We still got to keep putting them into here. Uh, we do have how many? Three ingots. Is that enough to make? Uh, let's focus on what's going to be the cheapest. What can we make so far? Battery. Welcome to the fray. Hold up. We got pineapple seeds here. What do, where do I put pineapple seeds? Just can I put them. There we go. Okay. We can grow some pineapple. Let's get it. And we got a battery. Hey, what's this thing do? I can put it somewhere. I, okay. I can't even do anything with it. Okay. So we got a mystery battery. Of mysteriousness that we can't do much with for now and we also got where'd that shark head go i just had two shark oh they oh my god for some i forget shark head stack why is this so foreign of a concept to me there we go that'll help us out in our inventory room i don't know why i always thought shark heads didn't stack for some reason <laughs> goes to show what i know let's keep on getting these things should be enough to continue fueling the copper shenanigans here Marvelous. That should be enough for us to craft up a circuit board. Yeah. Oh, we need vine goo too. There's gonna be a couple of things we gotta smelt then. 
but we should hey 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 no i know that sound that's the sound of birds poking my stuff S sit down eagle not eagle seagull seagull eagle oh my god i just realized that seagulls are like eagles of the sea when you think about it dear mom okay anyways we got some drumsticks here this is some quality food we haven't had the chance of indulging in i'm gonna eat this mango was that the shark latching on no those two noises confuse me, man. And sometimes I think stuff getting picked up sounds like the shark picking up a piece of our ship. Looks like that's not the case. And at this point, too, I don't even think we have to pit stop at islands. I literally think it's open sailing from here. Just got to keep on eating the good food, cooking the good food, too. So we do have to cook our own food, too. And are we? Oh, no, there it is. I thought actually, I wonder, can we cook like a variety of stuff? Is that is that a thing? Oh, dope! So yeah, you can cook any three things at once. I'd definitely say that shark meat's probably the best, just because, uh, well, the stuff, I, I'm pretty sure it's the best food in the game, pretty much. Three of those cooking up at the same time? That'll last you for a solid while. Anchor, still staying up, nice and safe. Birds! Dropping a feather. Can you drop some eggs already? Like, I, I don't think eggs are in the game. Yo! Raph devs, on the off chance you're watching this. Allow there to be eggs, so you can just go boop, and then an egg is there. Also, have you guys noticed, if you keep looking down, things get really freaky? Yeah, 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 you guys see that? I freaking, I don't even know, I'm pretty sure my body just got a twist in it. Alright, I look like a freaking soft pretzel. And now I'm hungry, because I haven't eaten yet. So look at what you've done! You made me hunger for soft pretzels. Foul demons. Just kidding, y'all aren't foul demons. Y'all are kind of fantastic and hold the phone. Let's actually no. I'm not even. I'm not even worried about that. No. Let's stay the course because here's the here's the double whammy. Last time we decided to visit one of those, well, we didn't get much except for a totally screwed up ship angle. Right now, ship angle is goat because look at all the stuff we picking up because of that. Uh, also, before we, oh, oh 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 I hear that. I hear that. No 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 no. That's gonna be no for me, shark. Nope nope. Shoe no wood for you. Dang it. We need a new one of those too. Uh, are those expensive? Uh, two metal ingots. Uh, I guess we could downgrade back to a normal spear. It, it was good living the upper life, but we got priorities, and those priorities are a bejesus ton of copper ingots at the moment. Luckily, oh, hold on. You know what else we should be doing? Eh, picking up all these things that are trying to fly by. We need all the wood that a man can get. Kobe, get back here, you stupid plank. Thinking you could escape my grasp. I've now, my total has come up to two planks. I know, I'm a, I'm a real baller. No need to tell me. Baller alert. Baller alert. More like nap alert. Is the sun down? Sun down? Sun down! AKA perfect time for the lay down. All right, so I went ahead, put another one in there. We can get all of these planks that are dropping. Funnily enough, all the planks are in all the same holsters. So we don't have to pick up any of that other garbage. Even though it's not garbage, it's definitely useful. But to us right now, anything that isn't planks... Eh, kind of garbage. Although, a second sail could actually be kind of cool. Can we get that pop? Yeah. Mm. Eh. Do we want to build a second sail? I yeah, yeah, we want to build a second sail. What's the worst that could happen? Besides, I don't know. Hopefully, it makes us a lot faster. Think about it. If we're a lot faster. <gasps> Yo, I know where we got to put the second sail. This is going to be as baller as it gets. We're going to make it like symmetrical right here. Oh, dear God. No, not right there. Uh, we might need to expand this a bit more. Maybe. Ah! It looks like it kind of... I think I know what we got to do. We just got to put, like, one thing down here. Why do I only have one plank? I thought I had to... I crafted the sail! Totally forgot about that. That's how it could happen five seconds ago. <laughs> Come on, Mr. Plank. Come on, Mr... Wow. Yeah, copper ingots really do take a sec, but... We're almost at the grand total that we need. We are going to need, like, three vine goo for the three circuits at the end, but... I seriously think that this stuff's well within our grasp, baby. Can I? No, we put the planks in it. Dang it. Keep forgetting. Keep forgetting. I'm telling you guys, that goldfish memory, I think it's enhanced when I'm in my natural habitat of the ocean. I don't know if a goldfish's actual natural habitat is the ocean, though, but it's water. So close enough, right? Like, ocean is just the big body of water, and, and fish just live in water, so it's the same thing. This. I mean, there's probably tons of complex differences, but for all intents and purposes, it's the same thing. It's like you, my friend, are not the same thing. You, a copper, would be entering into something different. 
Something needed. Something very circus-like. Yeah, three vine goo and we're good to go. One more cop ring it, actually. That's the last one we need, I'm pretty sure, until we can get these three things nailed down and crafted. So come on, baby. Because I think the seaweed goes a lot faster than this stuff, too. Oh, no, yeah. Now that that's put down, what we can go ahead and do right over... I just want to make sure that this is kind of even here. Let's bring her back. There we go. Check it. Check it. Sail number two in the exact opposite way. Sail number two in the exact same way. Will we sail faster now? Is that a thing? I, actually, that stuff looks like it's moving by pretty freaking fast. Don't know if it makes a difference, but hey, worst case scenario, we just started looking super hella doper because now we got two sails, all right? What about your next favorite ship? Probably got one, just kidding. I've, uh, other good ships probably have multiple sails too, but hey, I mean, they did this in ye olden times, so I'm gonna do it too. Although those ships were probably a lot more aerodynamic. Let's be honest, this is just a glorified raft. It's like a house on water. It's pretty nice actually. Uh, so before we go to collect the last of that copper ore, just make sure that we got this little backup supply during all that. Hello, Mr. Ingot. Now all we need is three vine goo and some planks to fuel them. I think we got those planks right exactly here. Might be enough for the vine goo that we're looking for. So I guess if we got extra resources, we could just work on the collection nets. But we got the battery crafted. Uh, yeah, we just got to wait on the vine goo for the circuit boards. And then the time will come. Uh, ooh, we also need a hinge. Never mind. Okay, but we need one metal after that. But for all intents and purposes, we're pretty much done. So that's dope. Let's put the unnecessary things away that we ain't in need of right now. Any room here? Yes, sir. Clear up a little bit of that. I guess we could put the fish away. We haven't really been fishing as of late. Haven't really had to. Still got that huge backup of raw beets. We could actually get to cooking those for now. Pick up that cooked shark. Have that there, because we're getting a wee bit on the hungry side there, let it. Food and water situations looking nice and settled. So is the vine goose situation. So is the plank situation. Mr. Circuit Board, it is time to enter my grasp. And for the antenna to enter my grasp, too. So we got two out of the three mystical items that are needed. All we need now is two vine goo and one metal, I think we need. Yeah, just gonna need one metal there, so. Three more schmelts, on the other hand. The sailing continues to be smooth. No need to worry about crashing an island or anything. All that we gotta worry about is putting all of this extra wood to some super fun use, because I don't think, I think we got more than enough to finish smelting this on up. Let's continue that second floor building, because listen, I'm honest, oh, oh, oh. okay. Did, I wanted to make sure that those things didn't go past me. That would have been a bit poopy. Let's get the rest of that. And do we need to go? Yeah, we already got these things set up. Hell yeah. Okay, so we're out of wood there. We just got one more plank that we can get for the vine goo. Let's get the circuit board we're coming our way. That's circuit board number two. Just need one more vine goo. And after this one, we just got to put in. Oh my God. Dude, we got way more metal ore than I actually thought we did. Now we just got to put in the last metal ore. But as long as we keep. Who's that? Is it just me? I just saw something. I, I wonder if there's going to be an island right there. Because I saw some kind of weird glitch on my map. And I wonder if that was maybe seeing an island. Is it rendered in? I don't know. I'm, I'm going to keep my eyes peeled over there. I'm actually kind of... Hey, 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 hey. Shoo, 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 shoo. Get off my freaking wood. I think he's going to break this. That's the poopy thing. Oh, not today, Sunny Jimbo. I was going to try to use this wood for other things than repairing. Eh. Uh, like, eh. I mean, if that thing breaks, it's, we're not really missing much, so I'll leave that be for now because we got to use two planks to repair that, and I think it just takes two planks to build a new one anyways, so, I mean, yeah, I'll just wait for it to actually break because that'll, that'll distract the shark if he decides to attack that. He won't attack anything else if you think about it, so kind of makes sense to leave it be. Hello, last of my trusty vine goo. Let's get the metal ore. And we are seconds, maybe not seconds, but tens of seconds away from finishing. Not the game, but I think the final piece of the puzzle to find the end. Oh, that was an island in the distance. Called it. You guys see that right there? Freaking called it, man. 
So that's weird. I guess if you guys are looking in the distance and you see like a couple of weird things floating above the waterline, it looks like it might be the island rendering in. And I guess it was probably like some of the random things on that island rendering in too or something. But come on, I'm thirsty. Give me what I want. Says the second circuit board I wanted. There's the last copper ingot. And where's the last thing we want to craft? Uh, let's, let's also make sure that we don't accidentally craft the wrong thing. Receiver. Just triple checking here. And one more plank too. And then the hinge. So can we get that one more? Hey! One more plank in. Hey! <gasps> this, th this is a longer pause than I expected to happen. I, I didn't expect one metal ingot to take, I don't know. It's been, well, it's been about 10 seconds, but I, oh, hey, hey, there we go. All I had to do was make it super awkward timing. The game loves to capitalize upon the timing of the awkward. Let's get the hinges. Let's crap the receiver. And here it is, guys and gals. It's time to make a little bit of a setup to get ourselves rescued. We're going to go and toss this puppy on the second floor, by the way, just for the sake of doing that, because uh, I need something on the second floor. Am I right? Of course I'm right. Put that right over there for now. We can put that over there. And then the antenna needs to go. Uh, why don't we expand this out one more maybe? If we could get the building hammer back in play, back in action. Did we pick up any more wood? We did, we did, we did. Beautiful. That should be enough to get the floor that we're looking for. Come on, stairs. Don't fail me now. We got to put that down. We got to get the antenna. And... Bada bing! Bada boom! There she blows! The setup itself, the moment of truth. Can we turn it on? This is for all the marbles and for maybe finding a way out of this eternal ocean that keeps on going. Is this where salvation lies? Boop! Antenna one. Oh, I need, wait, I gotta craft three antennas? Oh boy. Okie dokie. Looks like we need to go ahead and find the secret to success next time because I do think that we have enough copper actually, which is the good news. Yeah. Oh, bless up, dude. That's actually amazing. That extra copper we got was for a reason because turns out we did need more. So bless it up for playing safe. Uh, but yeah, it looks like we just got to move the first one further away. Kind of space the raft out a little bit. Maybe one in that corner, one in that corner, one back over there, and then... We'll be able to use this to like triangulate some sort of signal. I don't know, but nonetheless, a humble beginnings to hopefully an epic save. Maybe we'll find, maybe someone will save us with this. Ooh, 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 should not have that on. That does waste the battery. But uh, that's gonna wrap up this episode of Raft Survival. If you guys did enjoy, if you did, make sure to smash that like button and let me know in that comment section down below. Playlist down below for y'all to go ahead and catch up on the series so far. Make sure to subscribe to the notification bell, hit to stay up to date with the Raft series and all the other dope survival games and whatnot that we are trying out as well. But that's gonna go ahead and wrap it up for me for now. Thank you guys a whole ton for watching. Have yourselves an awesome one. I'll talk to you next one. See ya.